Hello friends, and welcome to the Chippewa River District Library. Will you join me in singing the hello song? Hello friends, hello friends, hello friends, it's time to say hello. Welcome to story time. Today we are talking all about autumn or fall. Fall is one of my favorite seasons. What's your favorite season? Today I have the perfect fall book to talk about. This is Leaf Man by Lois Ellert, and it's one of my favorites. Leaf Man by Lois Ellert. Whoa, look at all of those cool leaves. There's a ginkgo leaf and a maple leaf. Ooh, a honey locust. All kinds of cool leaves. Leaf Man used to live near me in a pile of leaves. Do you see the Leaf Man that's being made out of all of these leaves? He's got a maple leaf for a head and two acorns for eyes. Can you find his arms and his legs? But yesterday, the wind blew Leaf Man away. He left no travel plans. Has that ever happened to you when you've been playing in the leaves? Along comes a gust of wind and whoosh, the leaves go flying away. Hmm, I wonder where Leaf Man went. The last time I saw him, he was headed east, past the chickens. Whoa, what do these leaves look like? Do you see? Are those chickens? He went toward the marsh, over the ducks and geese, a leaf man's got to go where the wind blows. Oh, look, the leaves have made ducks and geese now. Do you see the ducks and geese? Hmm. I see a little leaf for the bills of the ducks, and the maple leaf at the bottom makes the perfect webbed foot, doesn't it? He flew over the turkey, past potatoes, carrots, and cabbages in rows. Oh, do you see all of these things are being made out of leaves? There's the turkey. He's got a leaf for his little gobble. And, oh, these leaves look just like potatoes. Which ones look like carrots? Can you find the carrot leaves and the cabbages? Wow, leaves can look like all kinds of different things, can't they? Hmm, if a leaf man has to blow where the wind blows, where will our leaf man end up? To find out, you can check this book out from the library. I'll put a link in the description below to check it out from our library, along with lots of other books about fall. Friends, it is time for a song. Will you join me in singing the leaves on the trees? So when it starts to get fall, we start off like the tree I have behind me with lots of nice bright green leaves. But then what happens? They start to change, don't they? They can change color. They might fall off the tree and fall to the ground. Hmm, let's sing a song about all of the different things the leaves on the trees can do. This is to the tune to the wheels on the bus, if you would like to follow along. The leaves on the trees turn orange and red, orange and red, orange and red. The leaves on the trees turn orange and red all through the town the leaves on the trees come tumbling down tumbling down tumbling down the leaves on the trees come tumbling down all through the town for this last part we'll need to stomp our feet to crunch the leaves because once the leaves fall down they're on the ground and they're very fun to stomp on and crunch and play around in aren't they so let's pretend we're stomping on leaves right now ready the leaves on the ground go crunch 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 the leaves on the ground go crunch 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 all through the town Grab your pen and a piece of paper. It's time to practice our pre-writing skills. Let's start with this letter. I wonder what it will be.
it's an F. Hmm, what will this letter be? A, then we've got two of the same nice tall letters. Hmm, what letters will they be? Let's find out. L, L, F, A, L, L, F, A, L, F, A, L. Friends, another thing I like to do in the fall is go outside for a walk. You can look around and see how all of the leaves are changing on the trees. It's just the right temperature and you get to see a lot of really cool nature and changes going on outside. So let's go outside together. Come on, let's go. Hello friends, I'm here at the park along the Chippewa River and I have been doing some nature walking and I found all kinds of awesome leaves that I want to show you. I found a great big yellow leaf, a beautiful red leaf. Look at this leaf, it's a fun little brown leaf. I even found some things that were not leaves, like this beautiful flower and this acorn. I actually think I have enough leaves here to make our very own leaf man, like in the story we read earlier. Will you help me? Let's give our leaf man a head. And this beautiful leaf can be his body. He needs some arms. And some feet. There's his feet and of course some eyes. I picked some little flowers for his eyes. And voila, there's my leaf man. Now can you make a leaf man? I bet there's some beautiful fall leaves out by you and you could make a leaf man just like mine. It's so exciting when you're out in nature to look around you and find all of the beautiful things that are just laying there on the ground for you to find. My challenge to you is to take your own nature walk and see what beautiful fall leaves and different items you can find on your nature walk. And please let me know about it if you do. Send me pictures of the beautiful things that you find. Wow, that was a lot of fun. I'm so glad we took that walk together. Friends, it is time for some fall trivia. Let's see if you can answer some questions for me about fall. First question, do we see pumpkins in the fall? This is an easy one, isn't it? So do we see pumpkins in the fall? What do you think? The answer is yes, we do see pumpkins in the fall. The pumpkins have been growing and getting really big and they're ready to harvest in the fall time. Do we see baby animals in the fall? Hmm, this one's a little harder. I know I've seen some animals. Hmm, but is fall the time when all the babies are born? Hmm, what do you think? The answer is no. We don't see a lot of baby animals in the fall because baby animals are born in the spring and they've had all spring and summer to get big and by this time they're like teenage animals. So we don't see a lot of babies. Do we see changing leaves in the fall? Hmm. What do you think? The answer is yes. The leaves start to change all summer long. They've been green and very lush and now they're getting ready for winter. They're starting to fall off of the trees and they're turning really beautiful colors right before they fall off. Do we see snow in the fall? Hmm, what do you think? 
Do you think fall is a time for snow? The answer is, I hope not. I don't like to see any snow in the fall time because snow is for winter, isn't it? Do we see sweaters in the fall? Hmm. I don't know. The answer is yes, we do see sweaters in the fall. It's starting to get a little bit colder, so it's nice to put a sweater like this one on so that you're nice and toasty when you go outside in that cool weather. Awesome, good job. We went through all of the questions and I bet you did great. Can you tell me how many questions you got right in the comments down below? Well, friends, we've reached the end of our program and it's time to say goodbye. Will you join me for the goodbye song? Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. See you next time.